Hello Zany friends, I'm Lainey. And I am Marshall. And today we're going to talk about Eight Perfect Murders, which is a thriller mystery type book. But before we start that also I want to say that all of the information will be down below for you if you want to purchase or check it out. It is about our main character who is an owner of a bookstore. He has written a blog post about the eight perfect murders that happen in a literary area. Uh, it, there I think is one play, but the rest are all books, you know, Agatha Christie, those kind of things, of, of murders that happen that are like in a perfect, you can get away with this genre, okay? I did listen to this on audiobook and I did it pretty fast. She did. Uh, when I was, when we were growing up, our parents really loved, well, they still love, uh, Agatha Christie, her Haku Paro, all those like PBS type mysteries and this book was like going back to that time period yeah. you're acting like you've read it just so you guys know I haven't read it yet but it's on my list <laughs> as soon as I'm done with the book that I'm currently doing I'm probably gonna go get this one and yeah. I'm going to devour it yeah it is it is kind of like a throwback to our our childhood in a way and so he he is told he there's an FBI agent who comes to him and says so I'm noticing a pattern with some murders that we have that are unsolved and they are following the pattern of this list that you wrote on your blog for a store that that you know he doesn't really even work at anymore and so she tries to start working with him to figure out the connections and if he is a connection between what is happening with these murders and this blog post that he writes because three of the murders are straight from literary the way that they are, the way that they are executed. The more that you find out about the murders and who they are and everyone's past in the story, it gives it like this, it, it just falls into place so nicely and you don't see it coming. Really? I mean, you might see it coming, but you're enjoying the book so much you just don't care about thinking about it, so, yeah. <laughs> Hashtag spoiler-free struggles. <laughs> but it's so good, and I gave it five stars, because it was it was right. just beautifully written, and if you, if you are a lover of mystery detective novels, you will love, the, love this book so much. You will love it. You will love it, too. I will love it. So thank you so much for watching, and until next time. Stay zany. Bye-bye.